so what's up guys best games here and I have a bit of a topic for today and it is about Black Friday um, as you know Black Friday is actually today so happy Black Friday and also happy Thanksgiving to all of you people out there um, who you know just want a happy Thanksgiving I guess but before I get into the real part of the commentary that I want to talk about I figure I should talk about this gameplay because this gameplay is the perfect, the perfect way you should use a shotgun in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. So I'm not going to edit on the screen the t uh, the custom class setup, but I am going to leave a link of it in the description for you guys to look at and enjoy in all of its glory. And I'll just go over it with you real quick. Um, it is the TAC-19. I have the enlisted version, the light trigger. I got it in a, in a drop and I was like, oh great, cool, this thing makes it fire faster and it's lower mobility, whatever. Drifter says lift mobility does nothing, which then he proves that it does something, but it's like ADS time and who the fuck gives a shit about ADSing on a fucking shotgun? Not me, not this bucko. So, we got that combat knife because as a secondary because fuck the pistols in this game they all suck um we don't have attachments with attack 19 because this was like one of the first games that i ever played the attack 19 with so i didn't have any attachments and so i figured okay i will just fill up on perks because perks are awesome so with the perk one greed as one of my wild cards we have the lightweight and overcharged because overcharged stomping on people is hilarious and fun perk two blind eye so you can uh you know just be all around a little bit stealthier. And uh, perk 3 Greed, we have Bless, Suppressor, and Hardline. You don't really need Hardline, I unlocked it as my permanent unlock when I prestiged. Um, if you didn't see that prestige video, link will be in the description for you. Um, and then we got Tactician, which allows me to have two XO abilities, which is Shield and Overclock, which I didn't really need the Shield, but the uh, Overclock definitely was, was nice. And uh, for Scorch Streaks, I got that Support UAV and that Support Care Package, because Support's the way to go. And uh, yeah, um, you could see the description. You, you could see the uh, class in the description, but uh, enough about that. So, Black Friday. I am a person who works in retail. Um, I, I've probably said the name of the store that I work in on recording probably once or twice somewhere on the channel. I'm not saying it here. Um, but uh, as long as I still work there, I'm not going to make it completely obvious where I work because, well, I have plenty of stories and plenty of things to say about <laughs> my job. And uh, I don't need them to come back and bite me in the ass, even though it is a minimum wage piece of shit job. But be that as it may, I don't need shit coming back at me. So uh, I, I choose my public words carefully, which is why I'm very rarely on any kind of social media as it is um, as an adult. As a kid, yeah, you can do whatever you want except, you know, post nudes, which, you know, those will come back and bite you in the ass too. So be careful about that. Uh, but anyway, um, Black Friday. Now, the trend, I've been working retail for, mm, let's see, three years, almost four, getting there. Um, and Black Friday, by itself, is not necessarily a bad thing. Black Friday is a great day for everybody to come in and get some really great deals on some, you know, higher priced things that they normally wouldn't get a deal on. So cool. Alright, it's kind of a mad dash for who can get the best fucking TV faster than everybody else, but whatever that the case may be, that's I mean, it, it gets it drives sales for stores. And stores need to exist in the economy just like everybody else. Um, to, you know, provide jobs and everything else like that. So, those make sense. Um, Black Friday itself is not, it, it's not a terribly bad thing. Um, it doesn't, it's not evil by nature. It, uh, it's just a little hectic and things have happened in the past that, uh, you can Google. And it'll tell you things like people getting trampled to death at Walmart and, you know, things like that. And, and they've taken a lot of steps to prevent that at a lot of retailers and security guards everywhere and everything like that. So, I mean, you're a lot safer now than you were a couple years ago going Black Friday uh, 
Black Friday uh, deals and stuff. But now this whole thing and the three years that I've worked, three to four years that I've worked, this will be my third Black Friday. Uh, actually, no. No, it'll be my fourth. It'll be my fourth Black Friday. Holy shit. Damn. All right, so yeah, I've worked over four years in retail. Um... My fourth Black Friday, every single one of the Black Fridays that I've worked, the store has opened up on Thanksgiving. The first store that I worked in, it was 10 o'clock, and that was the entire mall. They opened at 10 o'clock Thanksgiving night. Now that, not that much of a travesty, but it's still kind of fucked up. You don't need to open up on Thanksgiving for Black Friday. It's called Black Friday. Okay. Now... Now let's fast forward to the next store that I worked at, which I can actually name, Toys R Us. Um, I worked at Toys R Us Seasonal, and um, they opened at 8. They opened at 8 p.m., okay? And I found that to be a bit annoying, actually, because I was scheduled for the 8 p.m. shift. And I was doing the 8 p.m. shift to 5 in the morning, which, <laughs> yeah, that... Um, I like overnights, personally, but kind of kick my ass. And now at the store that I'm working at last year was 8, and this year is 6. Um, that should narrow it down to which retailer I work at. Maybe not the exact one, but gives you a couple ideas. Um, 6 p.m. And luckily I'm not working that 6 p.m. shift. I'm working midnight to, like, 9 in the morning. So... I'm going to be extremely exhausted on Black Friday itself, and that's good because I don't have the money to spend on shit, so that's A-OK -okay with me. But uh, it's going to be a sleepless night, and by the time you actually watch this, I'll probably be sleeping. And if I'm not sleeping, then, well, then you're watching this late. But, uh, yeah, so, I don't know, like, Black Friday itself is not a bad thing. Opening on Thanksgiving, the earlier and earlier this shit gets, is just ridiculous. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to leave you guys here because we're coming down to the end of the commentary, end of this gameplay, and I hope you guys did enjoy this shotgun gameplay. Um, I'm not going to use a shotgun every single game, but uh, it was fun to play with the underpowered gun and actually do really well and stomp on some kids. So, uh, yeah, that was fun. So I will see you guys on the next video, and uh, peace out.